bad problems. Hey guys. So we're back at the hotel room. Um, the tour ended. What time did we get off the bus? Huh? What time? Are, well, around what time did we get uh, off the half bus? Half hour ago. Half hour ago. So it's. Three minutes. So we got off the bus maybe around 11 40? 11 50? Something like that. And the tour is supposed to end at 11 30, but. He talked to us a lot, and uh, I en I didn't end up getting the rest of the Jewish cemetery that we stopped at, and we ended up going to another location, which was the Charity Hospital, mm -hmm. and um. There's three cemeteries also. I know, I know. Oh, okay. Grandma, I was on live on YouTube. Oh. That whole time. Yes. <laughs> No, you're okay. You're okay to talk. It's, it doesn't bug me. <laughs> See? Say hi. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, you're about to cut me your TV and your phone. <laughs> yes, I have, I have a small portable TV in my hand. <laughs> well, in technicality, it could be. Um, but yeah, so we stopped at the charity hospital, which was a free hospital used for people during and it got hit by Katrina in 2005 and um 111 people ended up dying and um no water no food yeah there was uh nurses and doctors that ended up staying until they could get everybody evacuated um and they finally did after one nurse's, like, dad came to try to get her. She wouldn't leave, so he called in, um, a fa he, he called in a favor from Fishing Game. And they brought in boats and stuff to come get the people. And, um, well, now today, um, there's no power in the building. They have made so many plans to try to reopen the building. But none of them have gone through. Um, and then um, even now, without the power, without even, like, light bulbs in some of the rooms, um, like, some of the, there's lights that are on in some of the rooms. And uh, when we got there, there was some lights that were on in some of the windows. And there's nobody there. There's a security guard there on watch 24-7. And he's armed, yeah. And um, the only way you can get into the building is if you have a special permit from the city and a hazmat suit because there is toxic chemicals and mold that is in the building itself. Um, and he, our tour guide was saying that the last time somebody actually was last in the building was in 2008. So nobody's actually been in the building for 10 years and there's basically no way to get in the building um, past the security guard, and, um, so, and there's no legitimate way that there would be any lights on in the building, and they've gone, they've gone in, and they've looked around, and many, times. many, many times, and, um, there's no generators that have any power in them. There's no light bulbs. There's no way for there to be lights on in the rooms, but there is. And um, sometimes they'll have uh, some of the rooms, the lights will flicker. Some of them will turn on. Some of them will turn off. Um, stuff like that. And then they dropped us off. Um... Um, in front of the one of the hotels that's along canal and then we walked back to our room and that's where we're at now it's a nice room to me yeah. it's my grandpa and then over there and then down down that hallway over there is the bathroom that's our closet get the tv up there refrigerator the safe is in the closet and then we got these really nice windows. There's two of them. 
and then our little desk. And we've got some photos hanging up, but this is our last night here. We're going to be heading back to my grandparents' place tomorrow. And then we'll be heading down to Florida. What day? Uh, Friday. Friday. Okay. So Friday I'll be <coughs> back in Florida. And I will be starting to get my dorm set up and get everything situated where I can unpack and I can get all my stuff done and over with and get my clothes hung up and put away, get my bed made, get my shelves put up, all that fun stuff. I don't even know who my roommates are going to be and I don't know how many I'm going to have. I don't know what dorm building I'm staying in. I don't know what dorm room I'm going to be in. I don't find all that out until I get there. So that's going to be fun. And then I also get my schedule. So I don't even know if I got the classes I wanted to get. So. Cross fingers that I get good roommates. And a good room. And the classes that I wanted. Because. That would be legit. Alright. Well. I just wanted to fill you guys in on what was missed from my live videos. Because. Um. By the time we got to the Jewish Cemetery, I was at 15% on my phone, and by the time we actually got off the bus, I was at 9%, and when we left the Jewish Cemetery, my phone was at 2%. So, I didn't want the video to, I didn't want my phone to die while I was recording, because I didn't know if it would still upload, um, or if I would be able to upload it after my phone died so I just wanted to be able to make sure that you guys got to see all that you know creepy goodness and our awesome tour guide because he was really funny his name was Toast yeah alright guys so don't forget to like comment subscribe share with your friends you know help a girl out I will see you guys soon. I'll probably do another video when I actually get to my college. Show you guys around. Even though you guys have basically seen it in my other videos. But whatever. Alright. Well. Bye guys.